All right, so welcome back to the geotechnical engineering portion of the review for your civil FE exam. Today in this video, we're going to be diving into phase relations. And so I have some practice problems for you all that I want to go ahead and jump into. All right, so number one says, using the following information, what is the void ratio? So they give us a volume of solids is equal to 150 centimeters cubed. Volume of water is 50 centimeters cubed. And then the volume of air is 30 centimeters cubed. All right. So where do we start? Okay. So we first start by writing down the given information. They give us the uh, volume properties of the sample. Um, okay, so we're trying to find the void ratio. Okay, so how would I do this? Well, first thing I would do is search void ratio. And I get to the once I search that I get to the geotechnical engineering section. And they let me know that void ratio is equal to uh, VV over VS. Well, what is VV? So VV is going to be volume of voids. Okay. All right. And so volume of voids over volume, uh, VS stands for volume of solids. Okay. So see VS is for solids. VW, this diagram helps too. VW, volume of water. Uh, VA is volume of air. Okay. So just some things to note. Okay. So if I know that my void ratio, so the formula I can start with is E. I'm solving for my E is equal to volume of voids divided by volume of solids. Okay. Do I have my volume of solids? Yes. So is equal to my volume of solids is 150 centimeters cubed. Okay. What about my volume of voids? Well, volume of voids up here. Volume of voids is equal to, they don't give us volume of voids, but they do tell us that uh, in our handbook that volume of voids is equal to volume of air uh, plus volume of water. Now, do they give us volume of air and volume of water? Yes, volume of air, volume of water. So volume of voids is equal to 30 centimeters cubed plus 50 centimeters cubed. So I get from my volume of voids, 80 centimeters cubed. Okay, so now I can plug that into my equation, 80 cm cubed. And so now I should be able to get my, the rest of my equation or plug this in to get my answer, which is 0 0.53. Okay. So answer is A. Hey everybody. I know I didn't take time to formally introduce myself at the beginning. So I did want to let you know who I am and how I can best serve you as you're studying for your civil FE exam. So my name is James Huntley and I am a civil engineer. 
who has helped hundreds of individuals pass and dominate their civil FE exam. Now, I know this test is tough. And as you're going through material, you may be saying, Ugh, I don't remember learning this stuff or gosh, these variables are so confusing or you just feel like you're really, really busy and there's so much material that you need to go through that it's a bit overwhelming. So I did want to let you know that I do help and work with individuals one on one to ensure that they pass their civil FE exam. And I've had individuals that have worked with me for 10 weeks and that's the longest that it has been. And I've had individuals that have worked with me for two weeks and we went back to back day after day after day, hours on hours on hours, putting in the work, um, working together to ensure that they went ahead and passed. Right. And this exam is so important because I know that you want to make more money. Um, I know that you want to, you know, get some promotions and be able to further your career and have your PE. So definitely want to open and extend a hand out. Want to be able to save you time, right? Because I know some people that watch my videos, you may have been watching my videos for six, nine, even 12 months, and you still haven't passed your civil FE exam. And that is the one thing that's keeping you from making more income, more impact, and furthering your career. So it's definitely costing you um, money, resources, everything. So looking to create more success stories, um, I am looking to work with individuals one on one. I want to hop on Zoom with you. I want you to share what you're doing as you're solving these problems so I can spot out what you may be struggling with and open your eyes so that you're not going into this test completely blind. Now, for some of you, you may have failed a test once, twice, had some people fail five times, um, or you may be wanting to take this test initially and you just wanna make sure that you pass it up front. So do have one-on-one -on -one services. I also have some uh, do-it-yourself uh, courses that if you're like, no, I got this, I got it all on my own, I know everything or I, I'm going to take the time to study everything. I do have some resources and materials to be able to help you in that way. But my biggest fear is that you're investing in something, uh, these programs or these courses, and you know, you're not uh, getting back or having proper feedback to help you and to push you forward. You're just giving a bunch of information and no one's sharing with you what you may be actually struggling with or what's keeping you from passing your FE exam. So looking to create a ton of success stories. So feel free um, down in the description box below. I have a ton of resources, including one on one coaching. Let's hop on a call. Uh, it's no cost to you as far as, you know, us talking through your goals and what you're trying to do. Um, and kind of getting a feel for where you're at. Um, so have some programs where I can work with you one-on-one. -on -one, and there's also some do-it-yourself courses, practice exams, study guides, resources, free material, all of that down in the description box below. So feel free to check out that stuff. If you like the video, be sure to hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. This is what I do. Um, we want to get you to the next phase of your civil engineering career um, and leave a comment if you had any questions about um, what I went through, the information that I covered um, and feel free to um, definitely schedule a call with me and I'm looking forward to creating more success stories. So be sure to check out this next video 